Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm back real quickly, but with some awesome news to report on. As we've heard directly from Coolstar, the developer of the Electro Jailbreak, he had some really interesting stuff to share with us, thus I wanted to pass on this information. So Coolstar just tweeted out this, letting everyone know one of the major surprises that is coming with the iOS 11.3.x, Electra Jailbreak. He says one of the surprises coming with said jailbreak is that an organized repo for now called Project Repo Unclutter will contain filtered packages from Big Boss, ModMyEye, and Zod TTD. He says only packages compatible with iOS 11 and presumably up to iOS 11.3.1 will show up on this new repo. He then links to a page where developers can mark their packages as compatible. Now this is just some awesome news that said jailbreak will feature a filtered repo by default to only display packages and tweaks that are compatible with iOS 11. It's sort of like tweak compatible but now built directly into these repositories by default. Now this tweet was rather confusing at one point, I must admit. When I first read this, it sounded like one of the surprises with the iOS 11.3.1 jailbreak is that it's coming early. Now I just wanted to clarify that is not the case. After reading the context, Coolstar is actually saying that the surprise he had is coming early and not the actual jailbreak. Again, while this tweet is rather confusing, it doesn't mean that the jailbreak is dropping early, just that one of the things that will be rolled out into the jailbreak, the iOS 11 compatibility filter, is now available for devs to add their tweaks to. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this quick video. Again, don't forget to subscribe if you want to be notified the second the jailbreak utility drops, as well as stay on top of future updates pertaining to said jailbreak. Don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and also let me know what you guys think of this new compatibility filter down in the comments section. But until next time guys, this is Tony signing out.